So welcome to uh, nightlenses.com chat. So we're actually in the outdoors here. This is the first time normally I'm on Zoom and I'm here with Diego Esquivel McGann, who's a, a footballer uh, with Linfield. So, uh, and who's in night lenses. And we thought it was quite interesting to, to, to find out his story. So, well, where's this name come from? Well, I'm half Irish and half Costa Rican, but I was raised in Costa Rica. Um, yeah, my dad's Costa Rican, my mom's from Northern Ireland, so yeah. Fab, so you've come back here, uh, you've got yourself into to Linfield. Yeah, uh, my mum helped me with that a lot, but yeah, uh, we've been looking at uh, coming back here for a while and just the opportunities that here that are over here are a lot better than in Costa Rica. So. Fab, so how old are you now? Uh, 17. 17, so now's your time to the academy, to going through and getting trying to push through to being a professional footballer, right? Yeah, trying to get over, trying to get over to England, obviously. So. Fantastic, and you've had a good season? Yeah, good season. I gather. Long season, but yeah. Fantastic. So we're here obviously talking about night lenses and the main thing is I think you, you were saying to me earlier during lockdown there's a lot of uh, Google classrooms and things and suddenly you just discovered that your site was, was going and, and, and is that what sort of happened and then you had to go in to get some sort of eye care? Yeah, long time spending uh, close up to a screen and uh, not really getting my eyes outside looking at stuff uh, far away and obviously playing football uh, and we had to go uh, to optician and see what was wrong. And, and so you started with soft lenses, right? Yeah, so with uh, soft lenses. Yeah, and how did how did those work for football? Uh, they, were, they were all right for seeing, like if I was just normal uh, day to day stuff. But like when I was playing sports, especially football, uh, it was really hard to use, very uncomfortable, and it would just fall out of place sometimes and sweat, and then sometimes the dust would stick to them, and it would be really hard to see, or one might fall out mid game, so I'd be half and half. Uh, vision just right and wrong so. so tell me so you know there'll be opticians might be watching this so it fell out mid game yeah. how did you put it back in was it a just a uh, well I, I actually asked what, what would happen if they fell out and she said just leave it as it is you can't you can't put it back in after it uh, touched the floor so it's impossible to find as well so that's right well the, the biggest problem of course is when people do put them back in it begs yeah, like that and, and of course then so if you did you have problems where you had to play either uh, without a lens in or a damaged lens or grit in your eye or something? Yeah, there were actually quite a few matches where one would just drop out even when if it, if it was raining, that's when it would always happen. Um, yeah, that would just really affect my performance and just really bother me. So we, we know that some uh, professional sports people, the biggest problem with lenses is when you have the problems, you're then aware of it and you're not then focusing on the game. Is that the sort of problems that you'd be having it? Yeah, sometimes I would just get anxious when it starts to rain and the game say, this lens is going to fall out, this lens is going to fall out. So just concentrating on my game and do what I'm supposed to do. Uh, so of course then you went on to night lenses. So the thing about night lens, you put in at night, you take it out, perfect sight. Okay, so you're now looking, so you've had a season. Looking back, what's the difference, the main difference between having night lenses, having nothing in your eye and, and you know, having a lens in your eye for them, obviously. Probably just uh, have, the, have the freedom of not worrying about the uh, lenses falling out or just knowing that you're, you're, you're okay for the day, you know, you're set, you're ready to go and as long as you put them in at night and yeah, just normal vision. So do you think it's made a difference to your game? Yeah, a huge, huge difference. Uh, just made me a lot more comfortable and actually I haven't thought about lenses in like mid-game in so long and it's just been really, really good. And I gather you've got the Stat Sports kit, so your stats are really good. You're heading off to a thing up at Arsenal, is that right? Yes, uh, 24th of May at Arsenal. Um, yeah, just glad to have the lenses on. Yeah. yeah, so I think the point there is, is, you know, you can train really hard, but the most important thing is nothing gets in the way, right? And yeah. That's where the night lens is coming. So I think, you know, the, the obvious question is if, if I said to you right now, well, we're going to put you back onto the daily lenses or a soft lens, you know, how would you feel compared to, you know, would you yeah. swap them? No, nah, definitely not. I would not go back ever. Uh, just too too much stress for for something that uh, barely does its job. Because even if it does, if it did stay in my eye, it would still move around a lot. If I would move my head in a quick direction, it just it just wouldn't stick, and it wasn't a nice feeling either. So we we got a lot of football players, um, you know, all sports and rugby players, others who who you know they're not aware of night lenses. And I think one of the important things is someone like yourself, do you now look at it having had a season now wearing night lenses thinking, you know, I'm putting words in your mouth here but I know where this is going, but actually it's a bit odd why people would actually choose a day lens over a night lens if they're a professional sports person. Yeah, definitely, like there's no, like the amount of benefits that you could have uh, with uh, night lenses and the disadvantages you get with normal lenses is just 
so many and uh, it's just a huge difference like they actually make to your performance and just overall how you, you enjoy and play your game. And, and uh, the big question a lot of people ask is, you know, so the lens goes in your eye, it, it, it um, corrects your vision overnight, you take it out and then you have perfect sight. So the big thing people say, is that for real? So this is, you know, this is, this is how it works. You, when you take the lens out, I think you mentioned earlier, you said something like it feels like you have a new eye every day. Yeah, it's, that, there's no trick. Like, it literally is just feeling so refreshed and like you wake up with perfect vision. Like there's no uh, side effects, it's nothing. It's just uh, great vision and yeah, as you said, it's like uh, resetting your eye, eyeballs every day, which is great and it feels so nice as well. Fantastic. And, and in terms of getting used to them, you, you just pop them in at night and go to sleep and so your eye you don't I guess you don't feel it anymore and uh, when you're sleeping the like the first uh, week it might be a bit uncomfortable but then after that it actually you get so used to it that you need some kind of pressure on your eye to sleep uh, well and yeah just take them out in the morning and that's it very simple uh, you don't really have to do anything and you don't have to be worried about them moving uh, at night uh, in your eyes so, Fab. so you, I mean you'd recommend them to all, all footballers or pressure footballers yeah, and any athlete really just uh, really, really recommend them. Too. Fantastic. Well, listen, good luck for your season. I gather you've had a, obviously a good season. You worked really hard, and and, uh, and uh, I'm a big Ipswich Town fan. We're hoping that one day we might see him in Ipswich Town kit. You never know. But let's, uh, thanks very much for your time. And look, you know, hopefully this has been useful for any professional athletes out there or, or anyone considering night lenses. And if you want any more advice and information, or even to hear any more stories like uh, Diego's here, head to nightlenses.com. Thanks very much. Good luck. Thank you.